What's going on, you guys? It's Aviation 484 here, and I'm back with another awesome video. This is the NG Models May 2020 uh, new releases. Uh, this is an this is this is an awesome release, guys. Like I'm so happy for these releases. I just want to say Happy Mother's Day for, to all of you. Um, I know it's not Mother's Day; it's the day after. But I was supposed this video was supposed to come out yesterday. Just got a little delayed. Uh, so. Yeah, uh, my apologies for that, but I just want to show you my input on these new releases. And I'm telling you right now, it's awesome. So, just want to recap from the old uh, last April releases. The Sun Country I, was the only one I got, but they were awesome releases either way. Um, yeah, I pre-ordered. It's still not shipped, but um, I pre-ordered from DG Pilots, uh, but it's still not shipped, so I think it should be coming soon. Uh, but yeah, so here we have the Gulf... Uh, so the sorry, the tag aviation seven five seven dash two hundred registration is Gulf dash Tango Charlie Sierra X ray. That's a very cool plane. Um, it's like the four season seven five seven from last release. Um, I don't know what these. Uh, this is the same registration seven five seven TCS World Travel Travel. I don't know what these are. Uh, they might be uh, separate companies, I think, or not. I don't know. I, I'm not sure what these are, but Four Seasons, I know, it was a is a uh, hotel company. Um, but those are awesome looking planes. If you missed out on the Four Seasons, I would probably get this these two. Um, then we have another. This is a, probably going to be a hot seller. It's Alaska Airlines seven three seven dash eight hundred registration is November five six five Alpha Sierra Skimitar winglets. Awesome, dude. Um, unfortunately, I'm not getting it because it's going to be very expensive buy because there's other two models I'll be telling you uh, what I'm going to be pre-ordering. But yeah, th this is uh, I, this is an awesome. I'm very happy for those who want it. Uh, that's really cool. I think Gemini just last released it back in 2016, so that's a long time ago. Um, I have the Max 9, so I don't really need it, but that's an amazing release. Now we have the Malaysia Airlines 737-800. Registration is 9 Mike dash Mike X-ray Foxtrot. This is the new livery. Uh, or not new livery, but it's the current livery. I think it came out in 2011 or something. A while back. But yeah, very nice. Uh, then we have the Malaysia Airlines 737-800. Registration is 9 Mike dash Foxtrot Foxtrot Foxtrot. Old liveries. That's a very funny registration. That's this is yeah. It's all that's an awesome livery. Uh, that's that was a cool livery. I really liked it back um, when Malaysia had it. Uh, yeah. Then we have Hebe or Hebei Airlines. Sorry if I butchered that. Seven three seven dash eight hundred registration is Bravo dash one nine three zero. Just a little uh, heads up. Uh, this is a Chinese airline because uh, Chinese planes are registered with B-4 numbers. I think now they have a letter at the end, but it's always starting with B. It's a Chinese. And then four other digits afterwards. But yeah, a very colorful livery, very interesting design. That's actually a nice design, actually. Uh, then we have Virgin Australia 737-800. Uh, registration is Victor Hotel dash Yankee India Victor Skimitar winglets. Um, yeah, uh, pretty nice, very nice aircraft. Then we have Virgin Australia seven three seven dash eight hundred. Registration is Victor Hotel dash uh, Victor Oscar Oscar. Uh, this is not the Skimitar; it's just the normal. But yeah. Um, very nice, very cool for your Australian collectors. Um, or if you like collect, if you like it, you can get it. Um, but yeah, then we have the Air Canada seven eight seven dash nine. Registration is Charlie dash Foxtrot Golf Delta Zulu. Um, oh, sorry about that. Uh, yeah, this is their old livery. Uh, I forgot to say that, but yeah, that's that's nice. That's really good. I don't know if they released it before, but I know they did the. The old, uh, the new colors, but yeah. Then we have a model that I already have from JC Wings, but it's the Air Europa 787-9. Registration is Echo Charlie dash Mike Sierra Zulu, uh, Spanish airline. Uh, this is the exact plane I have from JC Wings, which is very funny. The exact registration, everything. Uh, I did a review, I think, a couple of months ago, but yeah, that's 
That's really funny. But yeah. Very awesome livery. I like that livery a lot. Then we have something I'm definitely actually I'm actually gonna pre order. It's the United seven eighty seven dash nine registration in November two nine nine seven five. This is the new livery of course. And beautiful model. I've been wanting I've been waiting for this release for a long time. Uh, Gemini Jets said they were going to release it, but I mean, NG already has it. So, yeah, and I think, honestly, in my opinion, NG is, I guess, in a, a better mold, better, I think, mold and stuff. Uh, yeah, so I'm excited for that one. Hopefully, the United, that one comes in this box, the Dash 10. Um, that's an awesome box. Um, I missed out on the Dash 10, so, yeah. but Like, similar box to that, I'm not saying the exact same, but yeah. All right. Then we have a very interesting airline, uh, the Juni, Juniao, Juniao Airlines, or Air, uh, Boeing 77-9, Bravo-20, Echo Charlie. Uh, that, this is a really awesome aircraft. It's a Chinese airline, I think, based in Shanghai. Um, I don't know why, just, I don't know. Kind of reminds me of it as if it would be Japanese, but I, it's a Chinese airline. I don't know, but th those are awesome. That's an awesome livery. Good colors as well. Uh, there we have. Then we have the Air Canada Charlie A three thirty registration is Charlie Dash Golf Echo G G uh, Golf India Star Alliance livery. Very nice. Uh, I think Star Alliance should have. Um, kept their engines black as their special, but yeah, that's awesome. Uh, then we have the one, another one I'm pre-ordering is the Hawaiian Airlines A330-200 registration November six, so November three six zero Alpha. I'm oh, sorry, Hotel Alpha. Oh, I'm so excited for this model. Uh, I do have the Gemini Jets version, so I could probably do a comparison video in the future. But this is also one I'm gonna pre-order. Um, yeah. Um, uh, I've just, I really like their livery. It's a very nice design, so that's why I just want, yeah, it's really cool. Then we have the Sichuan Airlines Airbus A321neo. Registration is Bravo-307 Delta. Very nice. Then we have the Chongqing Airlines a Airbus A321 Neo uh, registration is Bravo 30 Echo 3. Very nice livery. Um, their logo is in a way similar to Korean Airs. It's not that much, but yeah, it's very nice. Uh, this is Chinese airline because of the registration, but yeah, that's cool. That's actually nice. That's actually a pretty cool livery. Then we have American Transair, Lockheed L-1011, registration is November 186 Alpha Tango. This is the 80s colors. Uh, this is my first, this ATA was my first, was the first LN I've ever actually ever flown on. Um, very nice. So that's cool. Uh, I'm not going to get it though, because I don't really need it, but that's, that's awesome. Here we have the TAP Portugal, or Air Portugal, TAP Air Portugal, uh, L Lockheed L-1011, uh, registration Charlie Sierra dash Echo Tango Echo uh, Golf. Uh, this is I think licensed, so this is a little bit more expensive. Yeah, so I think it that's a licensed one. That's awesome. That's a really nice livery. I think that was their eighties or seventies livery. I think, but yeah, that's awesome. Then we have the LTU Lockheed L ten eleven Tristar dash five hundred registration is Delta. Echo, a Delta Alpha Echo Romeo Vuliet, uh, sorry, Victor. Uh, this is the late 80s white roof livery. Very cool. Um, I think they merged, LTU merged with Air Berlin, I think back in 2009, so that's cool. Uh, that's in, that's a older airline. Then we have, uh, 1200 scale, not much as two, uh, which is quite surprising. Uh, here we have the Scandinavian Airlines CRJ. L100 uh, a long range. Oh, Oscar Yankee dash Romeo Juliet India. Uh, I think it, oper it said it operated by Simber Air or Kimber Air. Yeah. Very cool for your uh, very cool. 
Then we have the Nav Canada CRJ200 Extended Range Charlie Golf Foxtrot India Oscar. Uh, oh wow, that's actually uh, pretty nice. Wow. All right, so that's it for the releases, guys. Thanks for watching. Uh, I would like to know what you guys are gonna get. Uh, the model, just a little recap. I'm getting the United and Hawaiian. Um, Alaska was very tempting, but I get I already have the dash of the Max Nine, so I mean, I, I guess that'll that'll make up for the seven three seven. Oh, I just want to say I'm waiting. I would definitely get the veterans one, uh, honoring the veterans who serve. But yeah, I would like to know what models you're gonna get. Um, yeah, so that's it for this video, guys. Uh, I also like to know what you think of these releases. I think they're awesome. Uh, but, alright, guys. Thanks for watching. Subscribe, comment, like, and share this video. If, um, smash the like button. Hit the turn uh, turn on the no bell notifications. And I'll see you in the next video.